Hey. Straight off the bat, off the bat, like I wanna rip up the track. Rip. Let's rip to the track. And I wanna stick to the facts. Stick to the facts. Let's stick to the facts. I'm the seed of AB. I'm using a Jamaican um, Dutch pot to cook the prawns in and I've just set the stove onto a medium heat so we're gonna start by pouring some oil into the pan Make sure that it's heated up so when we do put the ingredients in it's going to be sizzling if you want to test if your oil is hot just get a little bit of your onion or whatever seasoning you have and then just dip it inside and then if it's sizzling like this one then you know it's hot so so what we're going to do is go ahead and put all the seasoning in I'm just going to grab your spoon and just mix it around. So I'm going to leave all the seasonings that I have in the pot to simmer for about two to three minutes and then it should be okay. So now I'm going to add in the prawns because the seasoning is soft and the oil has soaked up a little bit. So I'm just going to get my prawns and then add them in. I'm going to take my all-purpose seasoning. So make sure you're sprinkling it all over and evenly um, distributing. So now I'm going to add some ground black pepper all over again. I'm going to sprinkle some garlic powder, roughly the same amount as the all-purpose season. Now that I've mixed all my seasoning together, I'm going to put the cover on and leave it for two to five minutes. This is some Old Bay seasoning. And this is the amount that I've added, and I'm now going to mix it with water. And just make sure you stir it. Things are falling to place. Yeah. And I'm also going to add a little bit of vinegar. This is just to season the prawns and to add flavour. Ever since the day that you came up to today, you're the best that ever happened to me. So when I dance, I feel you inside me. And when I cry, you move my tears for me. So this our love is here to stay. And Lord, you know the feel. Everything you do is intentional. Papa, no, they use me to play. You take care of Papa. Now that you've added the old bay and the water and vinegar, you're now going to leave it for five to ten minutes just to boil for a bit, and then you'll be adding um, red label wine or any wine of your choice. We're just going to add a teaspoon of paprika just to uh, make the prawns a little bit red. Okay, so now that my prawns have been simmering for about five minutes, I'm now going to add my red label wine. <laughs> If you could smell this right now. Woo. So now you're going to cover it again and leave it to simmer for another five minutes. Make sure when you're making prawns that you keep checking it because if you leave it for too long and it overcooks, the shells will start to um, come off. So just make sure you keep an eye on it. Yeah, give the tips. So the prawns have finished cooking, so yours should look something like this. Um, it smells so good right now.
It smells so good. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Rip. Let's rip to the track. And I wanna stick to the facts. Stick to the facts. Let's stick to the facts. I'm the seed of AB.